Uh, awfully impressive when you can do it with the efficiency that Aaron White did. You see 11 of 14 from the field. So you couple that with the 26 points and six rebounds, better than 75% shooting. It's the last five times it's happened for a Big Ten player. Some good names on that list. Calbert Chaney, Chris Weber, Brandon Dawson, Kirk Haston, and now add Aaron White to it as well. As Sean, Iowa wins this one by 31, largest margin of victory ever for the Hawkeyes in an NCAA tournament game as they break a mark that had stood for 60 years. And White, a clear focal point for this team, he was as good as you can get. Dave, you look back when Iowa was 6-6 six and six in the conference after losing on the road at Northwestern. This season could have gone either way for the team collectively and Aaron White individually. And Aaron White, over the last six games of the regular season, through the conference tournament and certainly in the game versus Davidson, has answered that with a resounding, we're not going anywhere but up. Demanding the basketball, didn't force anything. And that's a shot in the middle part of the conference season. He's not only not going to make, he's not even going to take. And I think the fact that he is shooting the ball from the perimeter so much more effectively and confidently has opened up his driving lanes to the basket. He set the tone offensively, but it was defensively where I thought Iowa really did a great job against the team in Davidson. Came in averaging 80 points per ball game, did the Wildcats. Iowa holds them to 52. This is a team in Davidson that shot 40%. Uh, from three on the year, 21% from behind the arc. Iowa did their job defensively. That set up the open floor offense. And remember, when this team fell apart last year down the stretch, and yeah. they did fall apart, it was at the defensive end that they struggled. The defense has been tremendous here down the stretch ever since they kind of turned this thing around. Again, seven wins in their last eight games. They hold down one of the most potent offenses in the country. And they're going to get another potent offense now coming up on Sunday in Seattle, very close to Gonzaga's campus in Spokane. The Bulldogs beat North Dakota State by 10. Kyle Wilcher at 23, Kevin Pangos 18. They shot 52%. That should be another game where they will be going up and down. Will be a lot of fun on Sunday and a great opportunity for the Hawks.